throw a couple knives out on the table here. See which ones you guys want to see more of. Happy Saturday evening. Thank you guys for being here. We're switching it up a little bit. We are going live in place of Big Red EDC, who's spending some time with the family. We did a little trade off because, well, we were supposed to do some family stuff tomorrow and somebody got sick. So kind of a bummer, but want to be careful with everybody in the family, you know, keeping everybody healthy. So Big Red EDC will be on tomorrow, noon central, or I'm sorry, noon Pacific here on the West Coast, Sunday noon. So don't forget to check him out. Don't have a big beard as Big Red does, so I'm going to try to lock in the SKL vibes. Hope everybody's doing good. We got a lot of people here early in the chat. A lot of Zach's Daily Carry Crew as well. We got Pretty Fly for Knife Guy, Mark H, Mark Gonzalez. We got crew members, Douglas Dauntless, Rusty Knife Lover, Rusty Rockin, the Gold Class Crew Member. We got OCD for EC in the house. Also a gold class crew member and master moderator. We got Blade Ogre in the house. We got CK, gold class crew member. We got Crispy Critter here. We got Todd Carr, King Snake Jake. What's happening? Top Dog, member of the crew. Sharp Guy ATX was here early, member of the crew. So was Marcos. Welcome, Marcos. El Cap Attic was here early. Mike Schultz was here. Craig was here early. Craig's member of the crew. Craig Wilkes rocking it. I love it. Sharp Guy ATX having some good conversations with him and Crispy. Acid Test Kids. Acid Test Kids also a member of the crew. Let's see what else we got here. Make sure this one's set to live chat. We got Paul Bessmer in the house. What's up, Paul? Just relaxing, says Mark. Nice. CK is in the house, of course. Gold class crew member. As well as Eggs and Ham, a gold class crew member. We had Gone Awry here early as well. Welcome to Gone Awry. Demonock13 is here. One Minute Knife Review is here. What's up, you guys? Therapeutic Edge is here. Gold Class Crew Member and Master Moderator. Thanks for being here. Good to see you. Tom is here as well. What's up, Tom? Zach's Daily Carry Crew Member. Paper Tiger is here as well. Rocking that Gold ZS. Gold Class Crew Member. If you guys want to join Zach's Daily Carry Crew, get exclusive content, access to custom emojis, help support the channel, you guys can hit the join button down below, or there is a link in the description. You can get signed up. It is always appreciated. Help support the giveaways for sure. All the fun stuff we do here. Now, we have a couple cool things to look at tonight. But I also don't want you guys to forget, there is a giveaway going right now. What's up, John Agent? Matthew Russell, how are you? So I'm going to put a link to that right here in the chat. Do I have it on there? Now, Blade Freak was awesome enough and donated so we could hold this giveaway. So here's the link right here. I'm going to put it in the chat. Make sure you take a minute to watch that. Give Blade Freak on Instagram a follow. What's up, Spanky? Gold Class Crew member. Welcome, welcome. Make sure you're subscribed here as well. And follow the terms of the rules of the giveaway. Uh, some pretty cool stuff. You know, it's always fun when, you know, community members reach out. And they're like, hey, man, I just want to see if I can get a few more Instagram subscribers, you know. Be kind of fun, sent you some stuff for a giveaway. I'm like, right on, man. So huge shout out to Blade Freak. Thank you so much for doing that. CK dropping the donation for the super chat. Thank you, CK. A little shout out to CK. Appreciate that super chat. That is always helpful. Now I do have to say, I haven't got my YouTube monies for the month, but I had to upgrade. It was time. I was talking with OCD for EDC for like a half hour on the phone and he was listening to me struggle with the kiosk and it was just the whole time. 
Alkis, what's up, Alkis? Welcome, welcome. Loot 10 Tex, what's happening? Thanks for being here. Kevin Campbell, Gold Class crew members here. But he convinced me. He's like, it's time for you to get a thermal printer. 100% thermal printer. Oh my goodness, Peter. Thank you so much. Therapeutic Edge. If you guys haven't followed Therapeutic Edge. Thank you so much, Peter, for that. 13 for 13K. We are on a roll to hit 13K. So appreciate all the subscribers, all of your support. I love it. CPM, member of the crew, has got a Shirgov. Got a Shirgov, Sinkovich, Biodark up for Lotto on Recon 1. 150 pieces available. There you go. There you go. I appreciate that. I appreciate that. Rock and roll. Rock and roll. I love it. So you guys, check out a Therapeutic Edge. I'm going to see if I can get his channel link really quick. And put that up in the chat. So hold on just one second here. I guess I could ask him to put his own in. But, you know, I mean, he's busy moderating. You know what I'm saying? So I got it. I got it. We got Therapeutic Edge's link right here. There we go. Go check out a therapeutic edge. Give him a follow. Of course, great soothing a therapeutic edge for your knife needs. I can't do the awesome therapeutic voice like him, so just go check him out for sure. Mr. McKenzie, Gold Class crew members here. What's up, Mr. McKenzie? Todd Carr is here as well. Women Carry Knives, Gold Class crew member and master moderator. Thanks for being here, Christine. Always fun. Always fun. Mike Hankins, new crew member. What's up, Mike? Everybody give a little shout out to Mike. Mike, this is for you, buddy. Thank you for your support. <laughs> Napster Ninja's here as well. Mike, if you want, you have access to those custom emojis. Hit that little smiley face button just below the super chat line. You'll get access to all of those cool new custom emojis. I love it. Uh, also, Mike, please send me an email, zach.edc at gmail.com. I'll put it in the chat here. And I want to send you some swag, channel swag for joining up. So thank you for doing that. That is pretty awesome. Really appreciate the support. Oh, thanks. Yeah, the new logo is great. Um, we, you know, Pocket Metal uh, worked with him to get that dialed in. So that's pretty awesome. He got that all dialed in for me and, uh, you know, also included one that, you know, looks really good on here. You know, he kind of lightened up the Zach stuff in the middle um, to match the blade coloring. And I think it pops really well on here. So, yeah, totally awesome. Thanks, Rusty. Rusty Knife Lover's here. Gold Class crew member. Honey Bear is here as well. A Zach's Daily Carry crew member. Thanks for being here. Yeah, John says, let's not neglect that like button, folks. I do have to say... I, I followed along over on OCD for EDC's Instagram. If you guys haven't checked it out, go check out OCD for EDC's Instagram. Um, you know, OCD, if you want to put a link to that in the description, you can definitely do that. There's some, He had some fun times today. I'm not going to spoil it for you, so please go check it out. But I had to post a little Spider Co., you know, just in his, you know, uh, support. I support the mission. I support the mission. What's up, Big Daddy? How are you? Oh, thanks, Tom. Thanks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Swag's pretty cool. We got some new stuff going on. Um, new stickers are ordered. So this is the, the newer sticker. I ordered some more of these, but these will be here a little bit later. Um, but I did order the new logo that you're seeing here for everything. Member for 29 months, man. Thank you so much, OCD for EDC. Now, of course... Slick them all. Gonna be restocked this week. So make sure to put this channel, this website, ocd4dc.com, in your browser because what a great stocking stuffer for anyone that's a knife enthusiast or even has any knives. You can even go over and help them take it apart on Christmas, right? What a good Christmas present. You give them something, you slick them all their knife up. Get it all sabbed up, you know? I love it. But anyways, awesome stuff over there. Or, you know, maybe they got a shootout and you're like, hey, let's take that annoying glass breaker off there. Make it a fantastic little OTF. Now, 
What's up, ENG EDC? Welcome, welcome. Josh is here as well. What's up, Joshua? Also, don't forget, Top Dog, what's up? Don't forget, brand new knife alert. You can sign up and pre order one. Medford Knife and Tool. If you're a fan of Medford, all I have to say is go check out the website and look for VHS. VHS, I think it's 2022. They have a new OTF. Medford just came out with an OTF. You can pre order it. It's really, yeah, it's good for knives too. Exactly, Tom. Exactly. I will say, Napster Ninja, what's up? I will say this. The Praetorian blade they've put into an OTF. What? <laughs> it looks pretty dang cool. So, let's see. OCD for DC said, Molly and I acted like teenagers and went on a spontaneous road trip. We will tell you all about it tomorrow night at 7 p.m. Central. Whoa. Okay. So, don't forget tomorrow... To check out that because you gotta you got to do that. Um, let's see here. Oh, okay. Eggs and ham, got you, bro. Got you. Appreciate the text message. Oh, you pre-ordered your Medford OTF tonight. Okay, okay. Very nice. Yeah, it's pretty sweet looking. Now they have a dagger blade, um, no tonto blade as of yet, but they went with the Praetorian blade on an OTF. And I have to say, it looks pretty darn sick. Pretty darn sick, totally. Pretty cool. So, to recap, if you guys, you get this little Gerber Blade Freak, that giveaway, a Mighty Hanks Hank, with some Firefighter on it, and a Nafs Co. Lander in blue. So that's the giveaway stuff over there. Definitely go check it out. Blades and EDC, what's up? Just getting home from a concert. Nice. Well, welcome. Thanks for jumping in. I appreciate it. We're going to go over a few things. I got a couple little things in the mail that came in. Also want to talk about a top secret. Top secret. A 12-pound OTF. Uh, you know, Peter, I was thinking the same thing, and I looked at it, and I think it was like 4.5 ounces for an OTF, Medford. So kind of, you know, breaking out of the shell a little bit or, you know, Moving sideways a little bit. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. But yeah, 12 pound OTF. That's what I would think too. But I looked at it and I was like, I was pretty impressed with the Praetorian blade as an OTF. Now they didn't put blade steel in there. Um, so more details are coming, but all the specs are in there besides that. And I think it's going to be a pretty good super steel. So yeah, always room for growth. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> Yeah, they do look pretty hot, huh? Yeah, yeah. Uh, on the table here, we have the Hogue Deca, and then we have the Benchmade Bug Out and the Spyderco Para 3. Now, on the Benchmade Bug Out, these are titanium scales that are beautiful and make the knife feel incredible. And they're from Bashy Design. And Bashy only made a small run of these um, due to all the regulations was shut down a couple years ago and has not started back up. But I really hope we can get Bashy to start back up again. That'd be pretty sweet. In the meantime, Original Goat has come out with these version 2 DECA scales. And they also have scales for like some spider Spydercos and everything else. Um, these are the original version for the version 2. And I they just came out with a backspacer. And I'll tell you what. The backspacers look sick. So if you get a minute... Go check them out. If you got a set of these scales, I would recommend that backspacer. It's amazing. They do a, a full, there's the link right there for original goat. They do a full like, kind of like they did here, where you have jimping on it. So they put the backspacer in and it goes, it replaces all of this. And then they have a part that's a floating one and it's fully like, Oh, it looks pretty sick. So definitely check out the backspacers on those. You can get them in different colors, um, even custom colors. They'll Cerakote them for you. I did the all black to match the hardware. I think it's going to look pretty sick on this knife. So, and I think even fully Cerakote, it was like $25. Not, no, they, El Capdetic, not yet. 
I was talking with them at Blade Show West, and they're expanding to the bug out next, it sounds like. So that'll be the next model after the DECA. The DECA was the first one already in the works, and they did an awesome job. They came out with so many different mill patterns, and the ones that I really want to get, they're on there, but I got to wait. I got to wait till I get paid at the end of the month to get them. So I have those on my on my to-do list for, you know, the other DECAs. Um, but yeah, they make a, a kind of a, a double colored, it's like black and then they cross mill it. I mean, it's, it's gorgeous. So Peter and Christine might have some pictures she wants to hang in the living room wall. Just use the, just use it like a hammer. Yeah, there you go. There you go. Totally, totally. Turkey making a comeback. Yeah. in the poll Turkey's making a comeback. It just passed pies. Pies are at 34%. You would hang those? <laughs> Wouldn't hang those ever. Yeah, I got you. I got you. But yeah, so one of the things that I want to talk about, there is a super secret, super, super secret, top secret nonetheless, thing that I want to tell you about. And that is for Crispy Donut Community. Now you guys... You guys saw the, the stuff, the, the box of stuff they sent in last week. They sent me a cool little thing and they said, hey, you know what? We got a top secret thing. The knives don't drop until December 5th pre-order. However, if I, <clears throat> excuse me, I get a drink. If I give you this top secret link with a password, you can do a top secret pre-order for $5 off each knife. Or if you buy all three, they'll give you $30 off all three total. So you end up getting a, the three knife package full set for 150. So instead of 180. So it's totally awesome, totally cool. I am going to put the link in the description. Let's see if I can find my place again here. What's up Mike, yay? So here's the link to the top secret pre-order and you're also going to need a super secret code. And that top secret code is right here. So if you're planning on ordering one of those, you can pre-order it right now and get $5 off. And then use this code after you click on that link. Pretty cool little deal. So definitely check those out. Manny Z's here, Gold Class crew member. Oh my gosh, Uncommon EDC is here. And yes, Uncommon EDC. The PVK exclusive Malibus are amazing. I am testing my self-control as well. I saw that blue textured Malibu with black blade. Oh, I'm, I'm testing. I'm testing myself just like you. I would agree. <laughs> I'm testing it out. Testing that self-control out, you know? So that is really cool. But yeah, the crispy DC stuff, um, the crispy donut community, I should say, is a pretty cool deal. So if you want to check those out, and if you don't remember it later, just shoot me an email or shoot me a message. I'll send the info over to you. I'm going to do an official video with it this week. Um, that'll be in the video. So I had the video for this week, but then they sent me that, and I was like, all right, I got to refilm the video <laughs> because that's a pretty cool thing, and it's coming out early. Um, they're really just wanting to support the knife community, those of you who – you know, kind of support our channels. They want to give that information out. So can't go wrong with that. Can't go wrong with that. Talbert Tipton, what's up, man? Good to see you in here. Welcome, welcome. Good to see Talbert here as well. Very awesome. Very awesome. Um, okay. Yeah, long time to see you, Talbert. Heck yeah. So let's see here. It's it's 18 after the hour. We should probably do a pocket check. You guys want to do a pocket check real quick? Let's do a pocket check. And I know people, I know you guys, I really appreciate you being here tonight. I know we switched up the times. Um, but yeah, stuffing and pies, hashtag be up and hello everyone. What's up budget guy, FKT? What's happening? Pocket razors in the house, member of the crew. What's happening? Benchmade 945BK-1 for John. Very cool. Switch to the computer. Nice, Christine. Nice. Women carry knives in the house. Wonder why Protec only released reverse Tonto versions of the Malibu. 
I want a warning so bad. <laughs> yeah, they probably worked on it ahead of time. I'm sure we'll see more. Leland Phil, remember the crew's here. What's up, Leland Phil? Spider Co. Lava Flow PM2 for Leland Phil. Nice, nice. Big Red EDC in the house. What's up, Big Red? 13 for 13K. Thank you. Thank you for the super chat, my friend. I hope everything's going well. Hope you're having fun with the family. Tell everyone I said hello. Don't forget to give Big Red EDC a follow, and tomorrow he'll be on at noon Pacific. Noon Pacific in uh, my normal spot we traded so we could uh, take care of some family stuff and spend some time with the family this weekend. Unfortunately, we have a sick family member, so we'll be, uh, we'll be doing other things, I guess. I'm watching Big Red EDC at noon. Uh, Top Dog's got the Sovivi Voltac Tucson TS394 Zenith. Concept printed out. A premium version and off grid knives rhino version two a baby rhino and a partridge and a pear tree spider code dragonfly two warncliffe and k390 shaman in cpm m4 and micarta and smkw exclusive crkt minimalist and d2 with flytanium scales for rusty knife lover small and cozy with black micarta for spanky ad 20.5 for douglas quiet carry drift for mike schultz what's up mike kevin campbell Bridgeport Knife 395. Yeah, I appreciate it, Mike. Yeah. It's always good to switch it up a little bit every once in a while. Appreciate Big Red being open to switching and hope he's feeling better this week. You know he was under the weather last week, so Beyond EDC. Linear in Jade. Ooh, that sounds pretty cool. Olight Warrior 3S for Crispy. Man, my Comments jumped big time. I got to go back and try to get them all. There we go. PMP Big Boy for Blade Ogre. Benchmade Shootout for Paul. Doug Ritter Hogue RSK for Matthew Russell. Carbon Viper Fortis for Paper Tiger. Newest Knife, the MBK Slayback today for Acid Test Kids. Very nice. Maximet PM2 and a Sack Tinker for Andrew Arnold. Gold Class Crew Member also with the Macarta Scales. Benchmade Mini Griptilian and eight Oreo cookies. Make that six Oreo cookies. <laughs> nice, Tom. Nice. I've got Titanium 3V80 20.5 for Manny today. Rob, 10 rings in the house. What's up, Rob? Got the REI 940 and an Olight Baton 3. Nice. ENG EDC today carried the large, plain Jane and Cozy. Got from Omaha Knife. Right on, man. Thanks for supporting Omaha Knife. You know, they're getting rid of everything in stock, so visit omahaknife.com. They are closing up shop due to the owner passing away. So that's very sad, but so awesome that we could help support. And they're throwing in little discounts as well, as, uh, as well. So which ends up being like free shipping pretty much. Kaiser Sheepdog Standard from Mike Hankins. Newest crew member today. CK's got the HK Hogue and the Mini Osborne and Angry Watermelon. Finch Lucky 13 for Craig. Fox Knives Eastwood Tiger for Therapeutic Edge. M390 bug out for El Cap Attic. The Orion Knife Scorpio. Even shaved my face with it earlier for pretty fly for a knife guy. Well, that's fun. Hopefully, you didn't have too many nicks or slices. Iceman is here. What's up, Iceman? Got the DLT XM18 3.5 No Choil Skinny Slicer. Benchmade Claymore from Mike Jernak. Hang on to that sucker for sure. SKL tomorrow, 12 p.m. Pacific. There's a link right there from Christine. Thank you, Christine. Napster Ninja's got the Spyderco Spidey Chef and the Tasman Salt 2. Carrying the Spyderco Native 5 today for Uncommon EDC. Very nice, very nice. Roman's here. What's up, Roman? Let's see here. I think I might fall asleep, says Hollywood Tactical. Hollywood Tactical in the house. What's up, man? Good to see you here. Honey Bear 85. Member of the crew. Got the SPK Lamia. The PM2 XHP Warning. Lynch Northwest All Access Pass and some Jank by Jake. Todd Carr's got the Leatherman Surge Olight I3T Gerber Dime Olight I1R2 or 1IR IR1 I1R I I O O E I E I the Gerber Shard the SD Classic Three Carabiner Knife Cold Steel 8010 the Civivi Riffle the QSP Parrot Fifth Pocket. 
Carried a customized Benchmade bug out today for Blades and EDC. Very nice, very nice. Chavez Ultimar TAC Green Macarta Scale for Scott Yamada. Flipping a Kershaw Luca I got from a bro, said Sharp Guy ATX. Talbert's carrying the Leatherman. Nice, nice. Alcus has the Victorinox Compact and a Nipix Cobra XS Pliers. Mikey's got the Rosecraft Mohawk. Nice. Smack that like button, says Top Dog. Pocket Razor's got the Benchmade 940 M4 Vic and a Finch 1934. Nice. All right, let me see if it popped up here. See where my message is left off. Demonox got the pair of three in Maximet. That's what this one is right here, the Maximet blade. Very awesome. And then, of course, we got... Oh, where did that leave off? <laughs> and the Shaman, and the Shaman. Nice. Almost picked up a mini grip today. Oh, okay. Very cool, very cool. I like that, I like that. A bunch of stuff. See above, says one minute. Did I miss one minutes? One minute. Two minutes. Three minutes. Four. One minute's got a big pile of knives next to me. The TS301, the Mini Trudon, the ZT0560, the Bag the Letter X XL, and a Harrier on first glance. Finally able to get online. Slowly, slowly coming back to life. Very nice. Well, it's good to have you here, Hollywood. I appreciate you being here. Very, very cool. Nice. Okay, so what was I carrying today? I had switched back and forth between two knives today. I carried the Benchmade Shootout with that awesome glass breaker delete from OCD for EDC. Very simple to install as well. And he's got a very, very awesome video of how to do it, so that's cool. And then, of course, the Benchmade 940 in M4 from Blade HQ, the exclusive. Just, you know, it just talked to me. It was like, you want to carry some jade today. You want to carry some jade. I'm like, let's do it. Let's do it. So and then I had a few of these sitting out. I'm like, we got to show off a little bit of cool titanium, even some spider co. You know, I'm kicking around. I have this one um, compression made easy. I was thinking about dropping on here. These get, these get installed right here. If you haven't seen these before, it makes the compression easy. So you install them, pushes down on that, makes it a beautiful knife. EDC Renzo's here. You get those on OCD for DC also. Dot com. Dot com. EDC Renzo, gold class crew member in the house. What's up? What are you carrying today, EDC Renzo? 940, Zach Big Shocker. Yeah, I know. I hear you. Don C, what's up? The pair three. Yeah, this pair three is really cool. We got these. These were seconds. We got these at the Blade Show West in Utah. And it's Maximus G10. I mean, I think it was like 80 bucks or something. I don't know. Something like that. This one was kindly gifted to me by a good friend in the community. I don't know if he's here yet. He is. Oh, Eggs and Ham gifted it to me. So thank you, Eggs and Ham. Also a crew member. Mike, yay! Super chat. Thank you. Always glad to catch your lives. Well, thanks, Mike. <laughs> Gotta do a little like tune with those now. Like <laughs> Pocket Metals in the house. Member of the crew member. Member of the crew member? Member of the crew. And also master moderator. And designer of the new logo. So huge shout out to Pocket Metal. Still getting compliments on that every day. Donkey Dave's in the house. What's up, Donkey Dave? Appreciate you being here. Yeah, big red and I switched this week uh, so we could spend time with our families. It worked out actually really, really good. And uh, while we were chatting last week, um, I took them a little Dutch Bros. You know, you they, it's not on the menu. They don't really know about it. It's kind of a hidden secret, secret menu, but... They do their own medicine ball, kind of Dutch Bros style, similar to Starbucks, but not the same. So it's pretty cool. Uh, Molly and I are in a hotel tonight. We're on our way home from an epic road trip today. Be talking about it tomorrow. Showing off all the knives we picked up. Okay, okay. 
Picked up a bunch of knives. Nice, nice. Yeah, so it's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. I, I have a little insight to the trip. If you if you hop over to OCD 3 dcs Instagram, you'll get a little bit of knowledge of what's happening. But it's pretty cool. They had a fun trip. I'm kind of jealous, but the road trip for me was like 19, almost 20 hours. So a little bit further than I was able to go without flying. It'd be an easy flight, but a little bit longer of a road trip. You know, just saying. Okay, so let's see here. All right, let's see. We got something that came in. Let's go ahead and open that up. Let me look at my list, make sure I'm on track for what I want to do. There we go. There's the right one. Okay. Perfect. Okay, so we got a package that came in to the channel. Let's find out what's inside. And this is one that the post office lost. Um, so that was cool, but they found it, they found it. It's all good. Took them a little bit, but get the channel unboxing knife. Shout out to Keith the Knife Freak. Let's see if we can get this open without too much damage. There we go. Had an epic road trip when I was married. She went south and I went north. <laughs> Isn't that the truth? Oh, we got a little NASCO sticker. Okay, okay. I'm gonna hide those for a second, but we got some scales for a knife. Okay. We got a little knife in here. Got a little sticker action. Oh, we got a little mint, a little lifesaver. Very cool. Catch a Therapeutic Edge Women Carry Knives tomorrow at 2 p.m. Pacific on a Therapeutic Edge's channel. There's the link right there from Women Carry Knives. Put that on your calendar. Open that up. Make sure you mark it. And also, you guys, if you are channel members, uh, don't forget to hit the little right where it says subscribe down below. Don't forget to hit the little bell icon because... I know not all of you saw the video on the Benchmade tagged out and the tagged out scales from Rogue Blade Works. So check that out because I know you guys probably like that one. That one's pretty cool, I think. You do the voice? No, 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 no. I don't do the voice better than you. No way. I just try. I try. A little radio voice. It's all fun. Wouldn't miss it for the world. Heck yeah. We'll be there. We'll be there. All right. So we got the knives. NASCO Lander. The NASCO Lander. So let's check that out. Now you guys saw the blue one that we got. We got this black one. Black G10. Deep pocket carry clip. Oh, you missed the baby banner in red. Oh, no. So, I saw Amazon has it. Um, whose channel were we on a little bit ago? Lefties. He looked it up. Amazon has the Civivi Baby Banter, the white and red. So, Dawn, if you're looking for it, I know Amazon has it over there. And then somebody else said Knife Center or somebody has them still. Or maybe that's just what they were selling them for. But uh, Amazon has them in stock right now. So, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Yeah, the black one's pretty cool. And then I saw they had these scales. So I was like, okay, I got to get these scales because... Do I know if the SMKW Army will come back? Probably not. Probably not. Yeah, you, you know, yeah, exactly, Christine. Hit that little bell. You miss any of the videos. And then, of course, if you're a channel member, you know, you might miss a giveaway that's coming up soon. You never know. So these are the kind of OD Green G10. Black Mamba on the secondary. Nice, nice. So I think these are going to look pretty slick. Like this. I think that's going to be a pretty good combo. So I think, let's see. Do we have the tools nearby? I can't remember if these are T6s. I think these are what, T6s? Yep. 
So let's just swap the scales real quick on this side because I want to see what they look like in person. Ah, uh, Women Carry Knives gifted one channel membership and Todd Carr was gifted the membership by YouTube randomly selected. Thank you so much, Christine. That is awesome. Thank you so much. And then Todd Carr. <laughs> welcome to the crew. Todd, shoot me an email, zach.edc at gmail.com. We'll get you some swag out. The new, the new channel stickers that that emulate the logo that you see here. Those will actually hopefully be in Monday, they said. They're supposed to be in Monday. So if those come in, I'll throw those in there as well if you want me to. I'll, I'll try to wait to send those out, the swag packs, until Monday when we get those in. So that's pretty awesome, pretty awesome. Heck yeah. Oh, I'm sorry, Mark. <laughs> You'll take a hundred. Nice, nice. Yeah, they're pretty cool. I like the new ones. So lots of lots of oil on these. Nice and oiled up for you. We'll get some of that extra oil off. Hopefully the hopefully the outside of the scales uh, or the liners don't need the oil, but we'll see. We'll see. So the way obviously they designed it, the scale swaps are pretty quick. I also like the fact that these are magnetic, so they go on rather quickly. Now, the only thing you have to know about these, and I'll tell you ahead of time, is you have to be careful to get in there directly straight on with these, because for some reason they strip out pretty easy. There's a couple people that had problems with that. B for Baron, what's happening? Gold Class crew member, thanks for being here. So I think this looks pretty sweet. I think this combo is pretty awesome. So the OD green, it kind of makes it for me. You know what I'm saying? I like that combo. I like that. And I like the fact there's so many people that are making scales of it too. You know what I mean? Now there is a way to put this in here. So one's, keep dropping it. Hold on. <laughs> so one side of it has kind of milled out so you can see the clips will, or the screws will actually recess in there. So you just got to make sure that side is face up. So the screws will actually recess in there. So, but yeah, shout out to having the, the screws. So they're magnetic. Just put that in real lightly. We'll put in the next one. I know. Wouldn't that be cool, Christine? Just be like, let's see, I'm going to print these today. Just be like, rip, 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 rip. I do know somebody that has a 3D printer though, but maybe one day he'll get a he'll get the CAD files and put those on. That's kind of a cool little two tone design as well. But I think the OD green with the black hardware and the black blade really makes this one. It's pretty cool. So I'm not normally an OD green fan, you know. I do have a few OD green knives, but for some reason this combo just kind of grew on me. And of course, you know, it's about a three and a half finger blade for me, or I mean handle. And of course, you know, you can get to the end of it. The old Ben Banner test, right? Old Ben Peterson there. To print tie would be epic. <laughs> You'd have to probably get it pretty hot though to do that, huh? All right, I'm gonna put the other side on just because. Then we'll look at the other. We got two, two packages left that came in. We had three, but one of them was the uh, giveaway. So we got that opened up and posted. Backpack B has 3D printer. Yeah, you could ask him too. But pretty cool how they do this. Never have a problem with screws stripping out because I don't tempt fate. But, you know, even just like that, this one right here that I just did, it was pretty tight in there with a the Loctite. So the cool part is, is, you know, NAFSCO, you go to their website, those two, those two scale ones were in there pretty good. A little blue Loctite on those. Let's see here. I think if you go to their website, they do have the uh, the parts on there as well. You can buy separate. So you can buy different pocket, you know, well, not different, but the same pocket clips. You can buy the, uh, the screws, all that stuff, the pivots. Tie comes in a powder. Hmm, can we print Micarta? 
I don't think you can print Micarta, but there's some pretty close ones. And Justin might know, he's messed around with quite a bit of printing uh, different things, especially uh, the work he's done with his, you know, compression made easy is a CME. This one has quite a bit of oil up here too. Get some of that off there. Um, he, they might have some close that look like Micarta. Oh, that's pretty good. Yeah. Put them in front of your heater to loosen up the Loctite a little bit. Yeah. That's a great idea. So on here, obviously it fits right on top of those liners. They're milled out for them. So I like to do the, the body screws first, put those back in. So they're lined up. I don't tighten them all the way at first. Just get them on there. Andrew Arnold, gold class crew member. Welcome, welcome. All right. So we'll put our screw back in. It's already on there with the clip. Oh, I guess I need to tighten that screw first. <laughs> now that I got all the way in. Tighten it down just to make sure it's nice and tight. Yeah, it was funny because when we were at Blade Show West, you know, Ben was like, oh yeah, the showing the tool burrito off on the video, you know, hopefully you guys saw that. And uh, it was like, he ended up losing one of the screws that fell right off and he's like, well, I got more over here, so that's fine. <clears throat> so pretty cool, but yeah, I like this switch out right here. I like the OD green switch out, so get a little DGA, Gold Class crew member, what's happening? Welcome, welcome. What are you carrying today, DGA? Anyways, I like this. I like the lander. It's a little bit smaller than I thought it was going to be, but, you know, the big banner just came out. Did you guys see that? You can order the Wii Banter, the bigger version. So that's pretty awesome. That's out. And I think it's out in black G10 or green Micarta. Green Micarta is like an extra $5 more. So nothing too, nothing too terrible. All right. We'll put this stuff off to the side. I can smell that Lifesaver mint. Winter green. Winter green. All right. <clears throat> pretty cool. Pretty cool. Pretty fun stuff. Uh, did you, what are you carrying today? Oh, nice. Peter, you got one on the way right on. Did you go Micarta or did you go? Well, no, no, no. You went black G10. It matches your, the rest of your knives. I, I don't even know why I asked. I don't even know why I asked. hundred percent. I got it. My, my bad. I shouldn't have asked. <laughs> oh, nice. Did is carrying the small Savenza 31? Right on, right on. That's cool. That's cool. So Gone Awry says, yeah, they've been printing Thai bicycles for years now. The powder is lighter and stronger than alloy Thai. So it's a superior product when printed. Oh, very cool. Ben has the most even keel I've ever seen. Mind blowing. <laughs> yeah, he did a he did a fun little like minute video for Knife Center, which is pretty funny. It's over on their Instagram, I think. It was pretty funny. Did you see a Band-Aid in the giveaway video? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yesterday I had, uh, I had a little, little thing happen there. So it's, it's healing up. So we're good. But basically I had, I don't know if you guys can see it right here. I had sliced my finger open straight down when I tried to catch a knife, like, I don't know, year and a half, two years ago. And so when it, when we get our cold snap, it like, it like hammers all my skin through there for some reason. It just has never grown back the same. So I'm obviously not a lizard or anything that can regrow body parts. So nice, nice. Yeah, you're in the morning there. You're up for some coffee. Getting the coffee going. Heck yeah. <laughs> not hashtag not a lizard, not a lizard. All right, so next one coming in has the cool new packaging from Blade HQ on it. If you guys have seen, they've been doing some Christmas specials. Yeah, it's scar tissue, I think, all through there. They tried everything, too, because they were like, 
well, we'll just super glue it. We'll do this because I tried to super glue it and it didn't work because it just kept spreading, opening up and bleeding crazy. So kids just left and Nelly hit a little hard, a little too hard. <laughs> Nelly hitting it hard. Hey, you got to have fun. You got to enjoy when the kids are there. That's pretty awesome. Probably need to cut away from myself. It's probably the best advice I could give anyone. All right. You say, obviously not a lizard, but I feel like that's what a lizard trying to convince us he's not a lizard would say. <laughs> right? Exactly. That's what I'm talking about. Hashtag not a lizard. Maybe he is a lizard. Maybe that's what a lizard would say. All right. So we got Big Red's favorite packing peanuts. We will save those for him. We got a Savivi box with some goodies on it. Very cool. And some cardboard shavings. We'll save those with the packing peanuts. Anything else in there? Nope. But they do have cool new blue boxes. Have all their little knife logos on there. Pretty neat. <laughs> new thing. Hashtag not a lizard. Tactical peanuts. Yes. Tactical peanuts. Ready to deploy. Tactical peanuts. Yeah. I apologize ahead of time. If you get anything from Big Red, you probably have some packing peanuts in there. You ordered the super discounted Blade HQ knife roll. Oh, right on, right on. Yeah, and so I ordered a couple things for the channel um, during their sales. Oh, nice, a little Knife Life sticker. That's pretty cool. Put that right there. Um, also, with their orders, they're sending out the little Ranger Eye glow-in-the-dark patches from Blade HQ. You have a plethora of packing peanuts right now? <laughs> Nice, nice. Uh, let's see if we can get some light on that and get it to glow. Get our tactically fun, our tactically fun Arkfeld. Probably helps if I take it out of the pack, but you can see it'll glow. So you got that little gr green glow to it. Take it out of there. Pretty close, Mr. McKenzie, pretty close. <laughs> pretty close to that, pretty close. That's ready to deploy also, right? Said plethora. They do have great action on those tactical peanuts. So you guys can see, obviously those glow. There you go. Look into the hole and see the glow. Anyways, pretty awesome. Uh, let's see what we got in here. We have, I have to use a different knife because the unboxing knife will not cut these boxes without destroying them. Your cat eats the tactical peanuts? Oh no. Here's some hashtag poison for the trolls. Always included. Appreciate that. Okay. Giving away the Evo? No, I'd be in trouble if I did that. It is not my Evo. <laughs> All right, what do we got here? We got a little... Okay, so, oh, it's Big Red's favorite. The Civivi button lock. This one's in black G10. Kind of that black acid wash blade. I like the size of this. If they did the elementum, the standard elementum in this size, I think this that would be a total win. And I know some of you guys obviously can't use the button locks where you're at. Yeah, no glitter. Yeah. Yeah, this is Peter's colors. Peter, this might not be too bad for you. Have you checked out the button lock elementum? It's a little bit bigger. But it doesn't have like a flipper or a thumb stud. So deployments kind of just push the button and flip it out. Um, but good action, you know, blades locked in there, you know, with that button. So it's not going to fly out on you, which is kind of a cool deal. So you got to push the button down before it comes out. Oh, you have it. Okay. Yeah. I'm happy to send this to you so you can check it out. You got the green Macarta elementum button lock. Oh, nice. Nice. Hashtag troll poison. Yeah, exactly. Very cool. What's up, Joe? 
Joe Kasperick's in the house. What's happening? Oh, non-toxic? Oh, okay, okay, good. <laughs> oh, thank you so much, Christine. There's the link right there, the Civivi Elementum button lock on Blade HQ. And I think they're on sale right now, right? They're on sale for like $49, I think, or $49.99 or something. Let's click the link and see where it takes us. Yeah, oh, they're on sale for $56.93, down from $75. So that's a pretty hefty discount. That's almost 20 bucks off, you know? You're about $19 and change there. So that's pretty good. That's pretty good. Peter will leave the wacky die jobs to KC. <laughs> Moose Duty, what's up, man? Late night DSKFS. Yeah, welcome. Uh, Big Red and I switched it up a little bit this week. Um, you know, one of the cool parts about this, they always include some stickers, which is pretty nice. They also got the padded case they send it in. I'm a fan of the padded cases, you know, they include with knives, <clears throat> Benchmade. Um, you know, I do have a stitched Benchmade case, but it never made it to production. Um, but I'd love to see that <clears throat> Benchmade, you know, that'd be pretty cool. Like black with blue lettering or something. Gold classes could have gold lettering, you know, can't be that much, you know, we're already paying the... Paying the butterfly tax, as people would say. Oh, nice, Talbert. Okay, button lock for you is the best for you to work. Yeah, right on, right on. A lot of the tactical peanuts are made from cork starch, corn starch, and pets like to eat them. Oh, nice. I'll have to see if my dog wants one. Be like, hey, man, I got a treat for you. He's going to be like, what? He's like, no, it's not bacon. Not for this dog. <laughs> oh, that's pretty cool. So, yeah, um... Yeah, we might you might see a giveaway too for uh for something like this here soon. You never know. I'm just saying. But yeah, I kind of like this. I know, you know, it was kind of a a 50-50. People either loved it or hated it. There was no in between on the button lock elementum, but you know. I mean, you kind of swing it out. It does have that little choil there for sharpening, so that's pretty cool. Um, you know, it won't pass the finger test, so no good for Ben. They could shoot the blue box and give us a padded pouch, and I'd be happy. Yeah, that would be cool, Mr. McKenzie. I, I would dig the pouches, you know what I mean? Um, even switch back to the other ones, you know? The other boxes they used to do a long time ago. I don't know. Just my thoughts as a Benchmade consumer uh, collector. It would be cool to see those. I mean, I think, um, what is it, Hogue right now kind of runs the, the show on the stitched ones. They make some good ones, and I know like the Evo came in a really cool one, kind of opens up in the middle with Velcro, but yeah, really thin edge, oh yeah. This would definitely get me through some uh, some paper cutting competitions instead of the 945. Yeah, they, they, they instituted their, their new prices before the holidays instead of at the beginning of the year, so. As long as they don't do it at the beginning of the year, too, then it'd be kind of like, what the heck? But, yeah, I like it. I mean, size comparison-wise to the Lander, obviously way different, you know what I'm saying? So, um, let's see, 940 and a bug out. Kind of move that up. Give you a little bit idea of kind of size-wise of that. So pretty close to the 940 in blade length and handle. 940 is just a smidge longer in the handle. But pretty cool overall, pretty cool. So anyways, yeah, got, got this in for the channel. We'll be doing a review on this one. But good size-wise, I mean, I like the upgrade from the standard Elementum. Yeah, a standard Elementum stops about right here. So it's you know kind of in between the lander and the button lock. Concept has a great pouch too. It's top fold and tuck situation. Oh yeah, okay, yeah, I've seen those, yeah. And then didn't Kaiser do the like camo ones, the zippered camo ones? Any good method of clamping a 940 in a KME? I have not used a KME. Um, you know, I have some Workshop products that I've been using. So I haven't used that one yet. 
Jimmy Itz here. What's up? What's happening? Welcome, welcome. I have to also say a huge shout out um, to Pocket Metal and Jimmy Itz for the really cool Instagram story today for the live stream. <laughs> they put Zach Morris on there. If you know who that is from Saved by the Bell. Pretty awesome. Pretty funny. I loved it. It was, I was digging it. So <laughs> that's, that's terrific. So we got one more box left to open up today. Um, another blade HQ one. I saw two of the sales and I was like, Hey, that's good. You know, we're going to get here. We, we ha I had about a hundred dollars to spend. Um, and so I was like, let's bring these in for the channel and see what everybody thinks about them. We'll kind of go from there. And then let's try to do this one on camera without getting a finger or a thumb. Hopefully that worked. Yeah, it was pretty close. As you can see, it took out more of the cardboard than the actual tape. So shout out to Keith the Knife Freak. Doesn't matter what it is, we'll get this baby open. <laughs> Jan, what's up, Jan? <laughs> oh, we got a little, ooh. Little Blade HQ birthday sticker. Very cool. Well, that's fun. Some more tactical pet peanuts. Number 13, what's up? All right, I gotta move this out so I don't make a mess. Is this one empty? No, I'm just kidding. That's a little tiny box. A little box. Fair and Forge box. Now, there should be Maybe we'll have to use the other box as a, a pour into method. With that sticker, there should also be another patch in there. I don't see one. Well, that's a bummer. We'll have to be like, hey man, where's my patch? I don't know. We'll look for it later. But this one, we have the Gent 2.0. So we have the Gent 2.0 on this one. Let's see if we have a link for this one. Let's see here. Ferrum Forge Gent. I think I got a link right here. We will get that one dialed up. Give me my patch. Yeah, what's up with that? I was going to try to give one away. No fun with that. Maybe it's in the box, right? Maybe they surprised us and put it in the box. Let's see what we got here. Wah, wah, wah. Box is empty. Well, we'll have to follow up with them. Say, hey man, you were supposed to get another glow in the dark patch. Uh, you pre-ordered another for Father's Day. It came with a free sticker. They shipped just a sticker in a big box. Got the knife in a few weeks later. <laughs> That's crazy, man. All right, so this is the Ferrum Forge Knife Works Gent 2.0 in Jade G10. You have a Contigo by chance, one minute. Little flipper, full liners. Okay, okay. I can get about three and a half fingers on there. The flipper tab kind of works as a, you know, as a break there for you, but you can also get up on there. My fingers are pretty big, so that finger choil, kind of cutting a little close, literally, but I, I kind of dig that. It's kind of a cool look to it. Obviously, it's got the cool Ferrum Forge logo for the pivot. A little deep carry. I like how they countersink that pocket clip. Yeah. So that's cool. This one's in D2. Not a bad little Christmas time offer. I like the minimalistic branding. This one's a liner lock. Revolving Blades, what's up? Yeah, hashtag DSKFS and be up. Get up on it, Zach Stuff. Yeah, so I like this one. It's not too bad. It's kind of thin in the handle, you know, in comparison. But let's see what it looks like. Um, we got the Spyderco Pair 3 right here. So you can see size-wise, handle is pretty... Pretty big difference in the handle and blade, but lengthwise, pretty close. You know, pair of three is a little longer, but you know, it's gonna come down here. 
Oh yeah, the clip's not reversible. It's right-handed only. Definitely. Meh. Not, not too shabby. 2 a.m. here, going to bed. All right, man, take care, Big Daddy. Thanks for being here. Yeah, that's pretty awesome. That's not too bad. It's a little, it's a little guy for me. It's a little guy. This would be a good secondary carry, or if you're like wearing shorts or something like that, or going to church, you know. But I mean, quality-wise, centering's on good. You see all that? You want to look at it this way? <laughs> Suck it up, South Paws. <laughs> Tonto Griptilian. There you go. Pre-orders are for the adventurous. I'm an immediate gratification type guy, says Tom. Yeah, pre-orders pre are hard unless there's something that you really want to get. And then it's like waiting for Christmas, you know. Open, open, open. So that's good. That's good. So you guys, don't forget about the giveaway. I'm going to post that link up here one more time. Um, check it out. Make sure to, to follow the rules and get entered to win. You never know what will come of that, but we're going to do a live drawing on Saturday the 26th, sometime after 10 a.m. Pacific. Just got to make sure not to, you know, I want to do it earlier in the day so we didn't step on any toes. Give everybody, you know, a little bit of time to watch the video and enter to win. And then let's see here. We also have some live streams coming up tomorrow. So I'm going to post those up here really quick. We got Tri-State EDC kicking it off in the morning. Good old Tri-State. And then let's see here. We're also going to have, I'm trying to remember. I think we're going to be Therapeutic Edges channel tomorrow. After Big Red EDC at noon. So Big Red EDC, noon tomorrow Pacific in my normal time slot. Appreciate you swapping out the times. That'll be good. That'll be good. Jeffrey Dawson likes the pre-orders because my C CRS problem, but getting presents throughout the coming months. <laughs> very nice. Very nice. And then let's see here. We'll be on a therapeutic edge after that. And I think it's, 2 p.m. Pacific, if I'm right. 2 p.m. Pacific tomorrow on Therapeutic Edges channel. RJ has a live too, usually on Sunday mornings. Okay, I'll have to get the link for RJ's. I don't have it here with me really quick. Let's see here. And then, of course, OCD for EDC is going to be going over the big road trip that it sounds like he took or is in the middle of taking. Oh, there you go. Stella's Knife Obsessions going live. Man, there's so many awesome lives to be a part of. That's great. And then, of course, on Monday, we have Knives Fast. 4.45 p.m. Eastern, is that what I remember? I think that's what I remember. And then, of course, we can't forget Pocket Metal. Metal Mondays, 7.15 p.m. Pacific. It won't let me click. There we go. I was like, where's all the links? I got them already, you know, ahead of time. Want to make sure that, you know, hey, Big Red posted some. So did Women Carry Knives. Got the RJ link up there. Thank you so much. Yeah, awesome lineup for Sunday. I appreciate you guys joining me here live tonight. Um, let's go ahead and do a giveaway. Just to celebrate. Um, we got Thanksgiving coming up this week. So you guys... We will see you after Thanksgiving. So I hope you guys enjoy your holidays. Um, I know some of you celebrate it, some of you don't. But here in the U.S., we do have a Thanksgiving holiday. So even if it's just an opportunity for you to gather with your family, I hope you guys enjoy that. Um, let's see here. So yeah, we got about 77. We can get We can get the likes up higher than that. We should be able, yeah, we should be able to hit at least 100 likes. My name is Simon, and I like to do drawings. Now, Sue Chicken. Is Sue here? I haven't seen Sue here. Is Sue here? 
No Sue yet. Okay, if you guys, let's try to hone Sue. Sue Chicken. Uh, we need Sue to email me his address. Hey, you're welcome, Joe. I appreciate it. Thank you so much for you guys being here. Um, because Donkey Dave gifted him his swag pack last week, and he has not sent me his email, or I mean his uh, address, mailing address. So, Sue Chicken, if you watch this, hit me up, zach.edc at gmail.com. It's also in here. Wu-Tang Sue. Yeah, exactly. I'm trying to summons him. All right, cool. Yeah, thanks. One minute. So we'll get Sue his giveaway swag from last week. But this week, what do we have? We have a few things. We got a swag pack of all swag packs. And sadly, I'm missing some swag because I am out. So if you don't see your swag in here, <clears throat> big red, <clears throat> they're big edge. <clears throat> Women carry knives. Um, send me some. Or let's do a sticker swap. But you're going to get a DSKFS patch. Do something kind for someone. Also the holographic sticker. Some Zach stuff swag. A little limited edition. You can only get this at Benchmade sticker. Some patch from a company over in the mountains. Um, as well as a sticker from them. You're going to get a NAF sergeant sticker. A sticker mule sticker. Little Bluminati Ninja, Knife Nerd, Holographic, some of the newer Zach stuff swag, Better Than Cardboard, Lancelot Leather. Oh, it's all good, Big Red. I also have a package already labeled up for you. Like I said earlier, this thermal printer, saving me money and letting me print my own labels here, not at the post office. The post office labels don't stick, so... Oh, thanks. One minute. I appreciate you doing that. Uh, you're going to get some Flitz polish. You're going to get a Dylan Mallory exclusive poker chip with the swipe right for Dylan on it. Some of the Dylan Mallory stickers. More Zach stuff. Some OCD swag as well as the sniper one. And a puck pin from OCD for EDC. That's your swag pack for today. I can't give you this sticker yet because that's the only one I have. <laughs> so I will, whoever wins, I will send you out a separate envelope with some of the newer swag stickers after it arrives. So I don't want to delay this stuff getting to you because I have my handy dandy new thermal printer, which it's amazing if you guys do a lot of shipping, but I was doing like 21 or 22 packages that day. I was like, I got, I got to do the investment. I got to spend a little bit of money and do it. So spent the money on it. Um, hasn't paid for itself yet, but it will probably in the next couple months. So I'm down with that. <laughs> oh, Sue's a female. Oh, it could be female too. Then Sue, she needs to give me her address too. Then. <laughs> Mass faction stickers should be to you by Christmas, of which year is anyone's guesses. Nice, along with those uh, Kaisers or not Kaisers? Are they the Kaisers? Yeah, but I did. Uh, Grumpy Grunt's gonna send me his drop bear, so I can do a review on that with a couple other knives. So that'll be pretty cool. So shout out to Grumpy Grunt. I haven't seen Grumpy here yet, but shout out to Grumpy. Yeah, thermal printer is way to go, man. I have all the deeds on it. Uh, again, a huge shout out to OCD for EDC. Justin, uh, went over some stuff that he had and it's working fantastically easy. Um, using one of the shipping companies, don't have to pay a monthly fee. And I also get a discount from the post office. Send you the details. Okay. Y'all I'll send you guys all the details. I'll put an email together and send it to all you guys just with all the links to them. You can check them out. It's, it's amazingly simple. So and you don't have to spend the like three to 500 bucks to get the like big zebra ones or anything. I was looking at the one zebra one because Blue Creek Knives suggested it, but it was like 300 over 300 bucks. And then you had to buy the labels too. So this one ran me, I think it was like $102. So 
Yeah, exactly, Big Red. Yeah, and that's and that's that's one of the companies I've been using for this first week, and it's amazing. So amazing. Just you know, living in the dark, handwriting labels, you know, printing my own labels up, and you know, having all that. Yeah, exactly, Christine. Yeah, yep, exactly, Todd. Yeah, that's who I've been using this week, and it's been great. Yeah, shipping's been, and I didn't realize until I started using that shipping service. There's a holiday tax on the post office. Did you guys see that? And it goes from like October second through like January twenty second. There's like a holiday premium. Yeah, exactly right, Christine. Yeah, they don't charge the holiday price bump. Well, Pirate Ship does. Pirate Ship's been charging that on this side. Yeah, I yeah, I've been hand I, you know I've been using sharpies, handwriting my stuff, putting the labels on, and then the post office labels on that kiosk machine just don't stick. And then of course. The post office carriers at the, or not carriers, but the people that work at the post office, they don't use those same ones. They have totally different stickers and labels. And I was like, come on, making us use these new labels that don't stick. Come on. Yeah, they're charging the holiday one. So double check your stuff, Big Red. Oh yeah, thanks Mike. Yeah, 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 of course. Reading cursive. Yeah, it's like trying to read, uh, Graffiti art or something, you know. <laughs> uh, but we're also going to throw in. Worksharp sent this out last week. Oh, thanks, Tom. <laughs> they sent out this pocket knife sharpener, so we're going to throw that in this week as well. So we have that. So a huge shout out to Worksharp for sending that over. Oh uh, well, that's good. Maybe you get a discount then. You've been using it for a while then. Wow, Amazon Prime. Yeah, I, I ordered a book like a couple weeks ago. You know, I want to try to read again. And I ordered a book and it was like, you know, a decent deal, I guess, for a hardback book. You know, there are not too many like, you know, sellers of this book. But it was like, they also charged me shipping, like $3.99 shipping. So maybe the books are different on Amazon. Yeah, no doubt. Ask the test kids, wouldn't that be funny? Yep. So yeah, get your stuff, you know, shipped out early if you can, for sure. Uh, but we need something else to go with the giveaway today. Um, let's see here. What should we put in here? I have something right here. Not here or here so much, but right about here. And I think this is going to be what we're going to put in the giveaway. Let me double check the box. I think it's open. Yeah, it's open. Let me see what's inside here. I want to make sure it's the right thing. You do get some poison for the trolls with it, so that's pretty cool. Oh, yeah. Okay. I think you guys are going to like this one. It is sharp. It is 100% sharp. Faux show. New in the box. Hasn't cut anything yet. But... It is very similar to something that we've seen on the channel recently. How about a button lock elementum in Micarta with kind of the gray blade, gray stone wash blade. What do you think about that? Blade locks, pretty good. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, I like it. Yeah, so this will be a good one. Uh, unfortunately, with the knife itself, I have no means to tighten the pivot or anything like that. So this will be a US addresses only. So international, if you have somebody that we can ship to, I am happy to ship this to you. Of course, comes with all the packaging, new in the box, all that good stuff. So. Pretty awesome, pretty awesome. So you get the swag pack up here, you get the work sharp pocket knife sharpener, and you get the button lock elementum in Micarta. I think that's gonna be pretty cool. They don't teach cursive anymore? Ah, so sad. They just print their name. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna still do a numbers game. 
because we're not running it through any sort of programs today other than YouTube. So, it'll be a guessing game. Right on, DJ, right on. So, let me get a range going. It'll be one guess, one guess only. Closest without going over. Ties will go to a second round. US's address is only. One account only, please. And my screen, my master moderator screens, will be the final say. I remember learning cursive in elementary school and I'm only 20, says Corbin. Nice, well, that's cool. Amazon laying off 10,000 people right now? What? How is that? People are just going shopping again <laughs> now that now that the vid's done. All right. I'm going to get my... Thanks, Big Red, for putting the rules up there. I appreciate that. Go caveman style. Go caveman. All right, so let me get a range going here. We are going to go closest without going over. Um, let's see here. We should do something kind of fun. Let's see what we have here. That's not going to work. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. I understand what you're saying. Okay. So we are going to do... Closest without going over. One guess, one guess only. Go, doing big things for the holiday season. Hello, everyone. I've been lurking. What's up, eggs and ham? Uh, appreciate it. Sending my buddy. It's okay. Give it away. Win. Give it away. Give it away. What's up, Billy Moore? Chris Nair? Welcome. Yes, you heard the giveaway, and you are now on the live stream. So the paper is underneath the button lock elementum. As soon as we see it, start. From Master Moderator Big Red EDC, we will give you the range. We got to start coming up on the screen. Huge shout out to all of Zach's Daily Carry Crew for being here. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the tagged out scales from Rogue. Uh, we'll have some other ones here and we'll do a video here soon for the regular channel. Uh, okay, there's the start. So your range is going to be 500 to 700. Good luck. One guess, one guess only. Close without going over. Pre-done is the sun. Oh, that's silly. Marco Madison. Big Rick. Desencio. Trying to story time with Miss B. Story time with Miss B. Zachariah. Ah, oh, member of the crew is here. What's up, Zachariah? <clears throat> Hollywood, I think you missed a digit there. <clears throat> I only see two digits. The range is 500 to 700. Hollywood's probably sleeping already. He's like, I'm sleepy, tired, I'm good. I'm trying to get all my stuff done. All right, let's scroll through. Let's see if anybody's getting close there. See if anyone's close without going over. We got guesses throughout the whole range, so that's not too bad, not too bad. that <laughs> Hollywood you're so funny I love it eggs is guessing for pretty fly for a knife guy big reds guessing for Lulu and Phil doing something kind for someone yeah it's Thanksgiving coming up this week so just make sure you know you do something kind for someone Dane what's up Dane member of the gold class crew 500 to 700 is the range. 500 to 700. U.S. addresses only, so if you got somebody we can ship it to, heck yeah. Pretty fly for a knife guy. 
Yeah, it's a little different doing the, the late night ones, you know. Not as many people up watching. Hopefully we'll get some people on the flip side that'll catch it and uh, see some things they may or may not like. Don't forget, Crispy Community, top secret knife, you know, you can order. Get that discount in. So I'll be, I'll be, I'll be getting mine. I'll be getting mine. You know, standard orders out on December 5th. So that's good. That's good. Ha <laughs> One minute. Yeah. I got you. I got you. I even tried to drink some coffee earlier. I'm like, I need to stay up, you know? <laughs> Heck yeah, hit that like button if you haven't already. Let's get the likes up to 100. Let's get them up to 110, 120, 130, 140, 150. All right. Well, we got a good group that's guessed. We'll give everybody about a minute before we pull up the stop sign. So. What's up, Emily Lee? If you haven't got your guesses in, please do so. And don't forget tomorrow, a whole mess of awesome, awesome live streams here in our community. So go back, hit the links, get all fun with it. I'll see you on there tomorrow as well. Because, you know, it's fun, you know. And congrats to all the people who won today in the... Uh, Knives Live giveaway drawing that Lefty had. Huge shout out to Shane and John Evans for putting that together with Doug. So it was awesome. And there's the stop signs right there. So let's see what we have for a winner. It is kind of cool being late because I don't have to worry about other people, you know, streams coming up. So it's kind of like, yeah, hey, just kind of take my time, do our thing. 597, 597. So I didn't see anybody that got it right on. But I'm going to scroll back through and see who is the closest without going over. We got a 589. Is there anybody closer than 589? We got a 593 from Corbin. 596 from Micah D. 596, Micah D. That might be that might be it. We'll see. I'm a poet and didn't even know it. It's it's getting silly. I know. You can say it. It's okay. Oh, one minute was just over with 599. So we have a 596. Do I hear a 597? Do I hear a 597? 596 Micah D. 596 Micah D. Says Big Red and Women Carry Knives. And I'll say you were so close. <laughs> All right. Well, congratulations, Micah D. Please send me an email. Zach.edc at gmail.com. Congratulations, Micah. We'll get this shipped out to you. Don't mind my squeaking chair. It needs a little slick em all. But yeah, you guys, it's so awesome. Thanks for being here. We have some fun things coming up on the channel this week. We have some 940 scale swaps going on with Flytanium and Death Grips. We also have some really, really fun stuff coming up from Crispy Community. And what's up, Rip City? Welcome, welcome. And you'll see the video for the Evo 3.0. And you never know what else will pop up. You never, never know. But please check out the other awesome knife channels tomorrow and Monday and the rest of the week. Don't make any plans. Stay with us for the holidays. Uh, we'll probably also be doing a, a live stream on Wednesday. Um, we're going to be getting into some stuff Wednesday and I want to do it live. So a couple channel updates. We'll be doing it for everybody, but yeah, thank you guys for all being here. Thank you for all the support. Welcome to the new member. I appreciate Christine, you donating that. That was pretty awesome. Mike was able to use some new emojis today. 
So it's pretty groovy right there. Thank you to all my channel members. I'm also going to be putting out a channel member giveaway this week. So you guys, please check that out. And also give me some feedback on those tagged out scales. I know several of you already have, but if you haven't checked it out, definitely do that. So you guys, thank you again. Make sure to do something kind for someone. DSKFS. Have an awesome, awesome rest of your weekend. But most importantly, you guys take care. Thank you.